Well, first things first, Femi, welcome to the Millers. To begin, just tell us a bit about how this came about. So obviously, travelled to what, the Palace game two nights ago, didn't get back until like 4 or 5 a.m. Woke up today and then, yeah, took a bit of a long process, but got it through. Uh, you signed a new long-term deal at Bramall Lane before you came here. Uh, has this move been outlined to you as the next stage of development? Yeah, definitely. I think this is a step up championship. It's a league that loads of people watch, see teams come up and down. And I think it's just a really strong place to be. Uh, I'm presuming you've had a chance to speak with the manager, Liam Richardson, uh, before putting pen to paper on this temporary switch. Uh, how much of an impact did he have when it came to making the decision? Definitely massive impact. Obviously, speaking to the manager is always good, but when you actually listen to the manager, the way he was speaking to me and what he was giving off was just all positive. So couldn't wait to get the deal over the line. Uh, despite your age, you've had a really diverse career so far. I've been played in England and abroad uh, and from the Premier League to the, the Conference League. Uh, how has that helped your development so far? I'd say just being put in different scenarios, different challenges has just helped me mature a lot mentally as well. Whereas like football, when you're young, you think it's going to go it's not a smooth sailing path. Like you have to go through different challenges and various things to get to where I am today. So I'm just grateful for each and every opportunity. Uh, your last loan spell was with Rochdale, where you seem to enjoy a lot of playing time there. Uh, just how keen are you to make the jump to the championship and make your mark at this level? Played here in the championship about what, two years ago. And I'd say I wasn't, I was still quite nervous, but this time, Obviously, I've grown up and I'm excited to play against top players. Uh, you've been involved, like you say, you've been involved in the match day squad uh, in all five of the Blades' last Premier League outings. Uh, what are the key things you've taken away from being around the senior group there? I'd just say, like, how close you can be to the Premier League is, is crazy from where I've come from. And that obviously just, if you keep working hard, then anything can happen, really. Uh, Surely that's fueled your hunger to get out on the pitch and play some football, though. Yeah, no, definitely. Obviously, spoke to the gaffer for his best that I went out, got some decent exposure, and I think Championship at Rotherham is the best place to be doing it. Uh, and of course, development's the main reason you've come to play your football here at ASL New York Stadium. Uh, but have you set yourself any personal goals for the remainder of the season? Yeah, of course. Obviously, spoken to my family, my agent, got some goals in place for myself in order to develop and obviously make a career. Uh, and this is one that a few players have found quite hard to answer, but for the fans who aren't aware of your style, uh, give us a rundown of the type of player you are and how you like to play. Fast, direct, like to put crosses in the box, like to attack, like to defend. Just know I'll be up and down really.